one-off and incomparably well-preserved Alfa Romeo 8C. Like many others, the car was thought to have been lost to the turmoil of war or the ravages of time. But it has now been revealed after 70 years of loving care by the man who was given it in 1937 when he was 21 years old. In sports car racing, Alphas pass all others on sheer speed. In the late 1920s and early 30s, Alfa Romeo completely dominates international motorsport. Superstar drivers like Nuvolari and Campari are overseen by race team manager Enzo Ferrari. In this period, Alfa sends another young driver and a close friend of Enzo Ferrari to Paris. His name is Luigi Canetti and he wins Le Mans for Alfa in 1932. Alfa's 8C2300 model has been hugely successful in sports car racing and Canetti is in Paris to market the cars. They are partially built in Milan and then shipped to Paris and finished at a coach builder called Figoni. Only one of them is an open car, or spider. Different owners compete with the car across Europe. One of them is a man called Jacques Chancerel, who fits it with a huge fuel tank in preparation for Le Mans in 36. But the race is cancelled, and in the summer of 37, the car moves to a chateau in the Loire Valley. Comte d'Autichon presents the Figoni Spider to his son Henri, now in his 21st year. When the war begins, the Figoni Spider disappears from view. Eight C 2.3 Alfa Romeos are highly prized and rare, and to own one is to be part of a very exclusive club. Of 50 spiders made, only about 17 retain their original bodies. And only one of those, Henri Dautichon's car, is by the Parisian firm of Figoni. While researching an updated edition of his definitive book on Alpha 8C 2.3s, historian Simon Moore hears whispers about a missing car that is believed to have vanished. At his chateau, Henri Dautichon, the very man who had received the car in 1937, explains that during the war, his precious Alpha was carefully hidden from the Germans. Afterwards, it was used sparingly and carefully looked after, with the engine regularly turned over. As the car is loaded for transport back to England, the odometer shows just 38,000 kilometers. The car is in a remarkable state of preservation. The mechanicals are carefully checked without disturbing the original patina and paintwork. After its long slumber, the Dautichon Spider is now ready for the road. <laughs> 